We're on the way to the airport. Yeah. I'm on the way to have some fun. I'm excited. It is 9.34. Hopefully we can stop and get some coffee. Um, could we stop by Starbucks on the way? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of thirsty. Um, so, see you when we get there. I got my... Starbucks. Just wanted to let you know that. <laughs> We made it to the airport. He's acting up already. <laughs> As you can see, this is how my morning is going. He's acting up, cracking up, spitting uh, coffee out his mouth. It's just been a, an interesting morning. But I'm just ready to take this flight. So yeah, we'll see you in a little bit. I just wanted to let you know we're here waiting. I'm glad we arrived on time because the line was long. But yeah, okay. We're on the way. <clears throat> Slow poke is back there. We finally made it. That's fake. That's a fake smile. Okay, we're in the international arrivals line. I don't even know if y'all can hear me. Hopefully you can. Um, we gotta take one more flight to San Pedro after this. Okay, so what time is it? We arrived in we arrived in Belize City. We have to take another flight to San Pedro. Our flight is in like 40 minutes. I didn't think it was gonna take this long for customs, so we'll see what they say. Hopefully, prayers up that we make it. Okay. Anyways, let's just hope that we make it in time. connecting flight um it's a very small plane i think um the plane leaves at 3 40 but it doesn't even take off until i mean it doesn't even board until 3 49 so it's only gonna be like you can literally see where the planes are you just walk up to it like you're getting in an uber so we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna show you what the flight looks like. I hope you can hear me. It's kind of loud in here. Um, if not, oh well, we'll see. But yeah, we're waiting to take off. <laughs> so we're here, waiting for him. We also yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I took two shots. So I'm kind of feeling it right now, but it's cool. You can tell me tomorrow. A little glossy, but we good though. It's, we we they told us that the plane was here, but I don't see no plane. So the they trying to get us out there. <laughs> we were, were our plane was supposed to leave at three forty. It's now what four o'clock? Four something? Four what? It is four o three. So it's now four o three. The plane's not here yet, but it's okay. No. Hopefully, it's a uh, yeah. No, is that the plane? Oh no, that's just the. Thing, but the planes are like really small that I've been seeing leave. So hopefully, it's, it's about to be a struggle. I know that. <laughs> These 
Planes aren't built for 6 two, 300 pound dudes. That's for sure. And probably not even built for me. I'm 5'7". We ain't gonna talk about my weight, okay? All right. Oh, you gonna have to make it fit. <laughs> Is it the one in the back? Or the green one? Okay. I'm following you. Why me? Because they're going co pilot. Oh my gosh. Is it the first time going co pilot? Yeah. Okay, so truck first. I'm flying co-pilot. This is gonna be interesting. I'm scared. I didn't know. They, I thought they were joking when they said I was flying co-pilot. It's not a joke. Okay, y'all, I'm so excited. Oh, we're in the room, so I can take my mask off. I'm excited. Are you guys ready for the room tour? Like, it looks so good. I'm so happy. Okay, so when you walk in, here is the little, like, lobby area or foyer. And then here is, there's a half bathroom. It's beautiful, look at the nice little sink. Okay, and then this is the kitchen. Okay, cute little fridge and a nice little like sitting area. And then we have two patios. So this one, excuse me, sweetheart. So this one is the first one. This one is just kind of like not much of a great view but still cute little patio. And then here is the second one. I'm doing the room tour real quick, boo. I mean, no, it's fine. And then here is the second one. Oh my gosh, it is even better than I thought. So we did get it with the beach view. Oh yeah. This is really nice. And then we have to show you the bedroom. And then this is the bedroom with the bathroom right here when you walk in. It's a cute room. Walk in shower. And then here's the toilet. Has a nice sliding door. And then to our 
bedroom. And then, I think, oh, it's three balconies. Or did I already show you this one? Oh no, I didn't. And then this is one more balcony. I don't remember. This looks the same. Oh, it's in the same vicinity. It's the same view, but it's not the same. So, I was actually, I don't know if y'all can see. Okay, so I was actually nervous about the room because the, the picture just looked almost too nice, like too good to be true. But it is off of first impressions. 10 out of 10. I'm excited. I first Tell me what y'all think about the room. It's gorgeous. Okay, so I just changed and now I'm like unpacking my products just so that I don't like lose anything. I've already changed. I put on a nice little dress. Ooh, oh, it's a full size mirror. Let's see. Boom, here you go. Vibes. <laughs> okay, so. We just had appetizers. I had some barbecue jerk wings and flatbread. Flatbread. That was good. Like the plates are clear. So um, I got um, like some shrimp type of penne pasta. And we got some chicken stew or something. I got food on here. But some chicken stew, so we're gonna oh, we're gonna to see how that is. The food is amazing. It's really good. So we'll see. The food is actually really good. Like, don't you think? <laughs> so we are we went to go check out the gym just to see what it is oh wait look look this is like a nice little yeah so if y'all got some kids and stuff and you know you want to drop them off somewhere it's a nice little spot right here it's a little playground but anyways the hospitality is amazing they helped us at the um concierge helped us set up two excursions so we don't like water Nah, cause you can't swim. Hoodoo. All right, you can't. Keep That's the word for the trip, though. Hoodoo. Okay. Anyways, so we can't swim like that, and I don't really want to be. I'm not interested in being surrounded by sharks or anything. Wait, babe, wait. So we don't like, like we don't want to be surrounded by like sharks and stuff. So we decided, you know, let's not do the scuba diving or the snorkeling, which is what apparently san pedro was like known for so they helped us figure out two excursions um i'm gonna record this upstairs you know because this is it's too much noise we'll do this upstairs in the room he's drinking some nasty orange peel water he's getting fit though and he's so strong <laughs> okay so today was a great day we didn't even get here until like five o'clock so like it's um it was a short day but it's 8 30 now we ate dinner we went downstairs um and went to the concierge and like planned what we kind of want to do we're only here for four days but i'm actually very excited the concierge here is like really friendly the resort is amazing we went and walked to the wellness center and the fitness center 
um, just to see what it looks like and stuff, the spa and everything. Um, so tomorrow morning, we have to be downstairs. By 8.45, we're gonna do a glass bottom boat tour. We're not really into the whole snorkeling deal, but we, we don't do the water. I'm really not interested in being loose in the reef with the sharks and the turtles and stuff. Like, that's not my thing. That's not his either. He can't swim. Not at all. So, yeah. We decided we want to do something where we can see it but like still be to ourselves. So we're gonna do that tomorrow. And then we're gonna fly back to Belize City to do some ATV riding um, on, what is it? Tuesday. And then Wednesday we have reservations for this like all you can eat Jamaican spot. So we're excited for that. And then maybe we're gonna probably like the rest of the time Spend it like relaxing and chillaxing and just enjoying each other's company and enjoying like the space and stuff like I'm really excited like this room is beyond what I thought because sometimes the pictures almost look like too good I just it's like they look so good I ain't never really been there I don't really know that many people who's been so I'm a little nervous but I'm actually thoroughly surprised and I did a good job because I've never like planned a trip before. I usually have other people plan it. My mom did it, sis. She told me, she told me give me ideas of like places to go and stuff. But yeah, I did a good job. Great job. Okay. He's he's gonna act, he's gonna downplay my pick. <laughs> Sorry. But anyways, yeah. So we're gonna like probably hit the hay because it like gets dark here really early. It's already getting dark at like 6.30. It's 8.30 now. And honestly, I'm tired. I got up at like six this morning, which was what? It's an hour behind here, so five this morning this time. So you know, I'm a little tired. Um, so we're probably about to go to bed. Take a shower, go to bed, watch a movie or something and then get up in the morning so good night everybody and i'll see you tomorrow